open main spread PSD file. Here is a quick overview of the features and layout that you can add. We will get in more details to those in a minute. First, let's copy a background and monthly tabs that we designed. Go to the first screen. Select background layer, texture layer if you change it, and monthly tabs group. To select them, hold command plus click on the layer or group. Right click duplicate layers and choose main screen. You will see that selected layers are the ones we copied. Drag them up so that they will be under pages layer group. Select old background texture and monthly tab group and delete them. If you changed paper clip, let's copy it as well. Select layer with paper clip, right click, duplicate layer. Choose to copy it to the main spread. This layer should be on top of all layers. You will see that new paper clip is copied to the same position as it is on the first spread. You can change the page's color from white to any you want. Press I icon to reveal color layer. Double-click on the layer icon to open properties window. Here, tweak color sliders for the colors to change. Choose another output channel and play with sliders. If you check monochrome, you can turn pages to grey and even black. Click on eye icon to reveal or hide grid layers. If you want your main empty pages to be dotted, save this image as JPEG to use in Keynote later. Do the same if you also want to have lines and graph pages. Let's see now what you can do with monthly calendar spread. First of all, you need to make this month tab active. Select month name text layer and run the rectangle layer under it. Drag them on top of the monthly calendar group. Let's say you want your calendar started on Sunday. Just choose text tool and retype. Align text position with Move tool using keyboard arrows.
You can change font as well. Select the layer with text, go to character window and select another font. To select more layers, hold Shift. Change text color in character window as well. To change grid color, double click on the layer, select color overlay. You can also add dates, type them with text tool. Use move tool to position and resize the dates. When holding Alt and dragging, you will copy the layer. and so on. Don't forget to save JPEG when you are done with calendar page. To use the same monthly layout for each month page, do the following. Select January monthly tab and move it back to the monthly calendar folder. Select February tab and move it on top of pages folder. With text tool, type the name of the month. Save to back with appropriate file name. Make sure to save empty page with each month active tab to insert your other layouts. Select the month tab layer, drag it on top of monthly calendar folder. Hide monthly calendar folder, save to back. Let's redesign the weekly page as well. Move monthly tab of the needed month on top. Change your week start to Sunday. Type in the same way we did with monthly calendar. Select all text layers to change color and font.
change grid color. Now do and save weekly layout for each month as we did before. Tip: Press Command plus Z to undo previous action. Using Shift plus Command plus right brackets and undo combination, you can quickly make pages with active month tabs. 